video is going to explain the best and most effective ways to bundle your products. Bundling products can help you maximize your sales and your profits. So we'll talk about, first of all, what is product bundling, why it works, how to choose the best products to bundle and some additional tips for effective product bundling. Product bundling can be a really great way for you to increase the average size of your sales. So the sales will be a larger dollar amount and your profits. The trick is you have to understand which products go together to make it effective. Product bundling is the process of grouping two or more products together to sell. So you essentially want to make the purchasing process easy for your customer to increase your profits. Often bundles are priced at a slightly lower level from the total price of each individual piece. So let's look at a little example here. This Etsy seller is bundling four seasonal books together. So there's a fall, winter, spring, and summer book. They're selling it as a single bundle. And this bundle would be slightly less than the cost of buying each of those four books separately. You can see that this is logical. These books appear to go together. They could be really good for preschool students or even possibly kindergarten students who are learning about the seasons. So this is a logical bundle to offer. There's three reasons that product bundles increase sales and profits. The first one is that they offer convenience. It can be much easier for a customer who's trying to plan a party or do a, a unit on seasons with their child to, uh, to purchase a single item and go through the checkout process with a single item than to purchase four items or eight items. They offer value like we've been talking about. These bundles are often priced a little bit less than the cost of the individual pieces together. And product bundles also help you increase awareness of new products or those that aren't best sellers yet. So if you take one or two of your best selling products and bundle them with something that you just came out with or something that doesn't have a lot of reviews yet, that can be a good way to get the word out. So if a customer comes to your shop, they're looking to plan their child's birthday party, of course, it's much easier for them to purchase the invitation and the games and the cupcake toppers and the decorations all as a single bundle than it is to search through your shop and look for each individual thing that matches and add it to their cart. So product bundles definitely offer convenience. So this Etsy seller offers a bundle of 40 different wedding templates and she's charging $17.95 for this bundle. If a customer decided they were going to buy each individual piece, each of these pieces is between $5 and $8. So you can see that it is much more cost effective for the customer to select the bundle. So product bundles can definitely offer value. And finally, they can increase awareness. So if this shop, for example, was already selling a lot of flashcards and these were really good sellers, they wanted to promote their line of worksheets. They could do exactly what you see here where they have bundled the worksheets with the flashcard. Okay, so we have proven that product bundling can be a really good choice, but now how do you choose which products you're going to bundle? There's a few strategies that I recommend. If you already have a shop that makes a reasonable number of sales, you can definitely review your analytics to determine which products customers are buying together. And then you can choose to offer those as a bundle. You can also bundle products that can be used together. For example, the birthday party bundle that we looked at, that makes sense. Someone is likely to use all of those products during a single short time period. The same with the wedding bundle. You should always keep convenience in mind to make sure that you're providing your customers with an easy way to get what they need. Some other tips to create useful bundles. It's kind of fun to come up with snappy, compelling names for your bundles. Those can really get people's attention. Of course, you can test out different combinations of products to see which bundles perform well. Obviously, you're going to want to price your bundles attractively. And if you haven't thought about seasonal bundles, those can be really fun. So take a look at this bundled Thanksgiving wall art set. This is a single download. Once purchased, the customers can print and frame all of these together, hang them on the wall, and they've essentially decorated their house for Thanksgiving with just one purchase. So this is a really quick and budget-friendly alternative for customers that are looking to decorate their homes. No matter what kind of content you're looking to create, my automated content bundle can help. 
I've got four popular automated content solutions to help you quickly access, create, and use customizable content. No matter what type of content you're looking to create, you'll find what you need to do it more quickly and easily with this bundle. It's perfect for people who want to turn public domain content into unique products, people who want to create cheat sheets with just a few clicks, and beginners looking for the latest content hacks. To learn more about this bundle, go to amyharrop.com, my website, and it is the automated content bundle.